In a world where workers with disabilities are challenged by their work environment. I'm always looking for ways to overcome the challenges in my work environment. A team of dedicated students is determined to make a difference. Jarena Porterfield is a receptionist at the UCP Center in Hopak. She has cerebral palsy. We serve people who have any type of physical disability and some of them have cognitive disabilities as well and some of them are normal range cognitively and as you know, certainly equally if not brighter than I am. Only about one-third of the individuals we serve have cerebral palsy which is a neuromotor disability. Uh, that means the message doesn't get through from the brain to I know I want to reach my arm out forward I could have 160 IQ but that message isn't going to get through. Mainly I greet visitors and I do the switchboard and then there's a paperwork part of my job that's been added over time and that is that I help the purchasing department with faxing and copying and processing of our purchase orders for supplies that the agency needs. In her workplace, Jarena faces certain challenges that jeopardize her safety. Jarena has difficulty using the copy machine. She has a limited range of motion and is nearsighted, so she must navigate herself around the copier to access all input and output areas. Because she is nearsighted, she must lean in close to the screen, which poses a safety issue, as this increases her risk of falling out of her wheelchair. When Jarena needs to use the bottom draw on her non-dominant side, each axis unbalances her, causing a safety issue. The same applies to reaching the shelf above her. To retrieve materials that are too high, she must first pull out a box, creating a potentially unsafe situation, as the box can fall off the shelf. Once we knew what we had to do, we began the design process. We researched Cerebral Palsy, the United Cerebral Palsy Center, and products currently available on the market. Then we brainstormed. We came up with various ideas and sketches. Eventually, we came to a consensus. To define our working parameters, we took measurements of Jarena's workspace. Once we had our measurements and idea, we created a set of working drawings. The program we used was Autodesk Inventor 2009. On top of the desk, we have three plexiglass extensions. There are two drawer glides under each of the side ones and three under the center one. On top of the three plexiglasses, we have Lazy Susans, and on top of the side Lazy Susans, there are filing shelves to organize papers. The filing shelves attach with Velcro and are removable. Each shelf can be pulled out separately to allow versatile storage. And the second one has a printer and is bent to allow access to all the sides of the printer. In the top cabinet, we have a wooden shelf that extends. There are glides along the bottom on which it slides and a knob inserted inside to help pull it out. The bottom right drawer is motorized to raise up and it consists of two stacked wooden boxes and the motor raises the glide with gears tip welded onto it. Any electromechanic device, such as our elevating drawer, has inherent safety concerns. We address these concerns through various methods. The momentary switch works only when the user holds it down. The up and down limit switches halt motion when the drawer gets too high or too low. The drawer safety switch halts motion when the drawer is closed. Instead of me leaning way over to get um, supplies that I store in here, I can just hit this switch and the floor comes up to me. I can pull this out and be a lot safer, safer in my wheelchair and actually reach things that I couldn't reach before. And once again, this is another um, storage area, a place where I can keep supplies. I can turn it all the way around. There are other similar products currently available on the market. However, their prices are often unfavorable and they occupy an excessive amount of space, not integrating well into the office environment. Their ways of accommodating the printer are inconvenient. These products can range from printing stands and printer cards to mounting units designed to specific printers and adjustable desks. The Nano system is unique in its modular, universal, unobtrusive, all-encompassing design. It consists of many cooperative pieces can be modified to the existing workspace and its user is granted complete control over his or her work area. My dream machine would be something that I could deal with by myself. So I just let it with the lights turned out again I lost my place but I can't stop this story I found my way but until then I'm only spinning I'm keeping
Keeping quiet till the phone stops ringing Lately it's hard to disconnect, I just want something real I find my words if I can just stop thinking 